Hey guys, Running Kimono here. I hope you're all having a wonderful Monday. It is Monday, May the 18th of 2020. We're going to go through some clearance finds that I found here at uh, a couple local stores. I'm in Michigan and uh, how clearance works, it's always a year mileage may vary. What might be clearing in my area may already be on clearance in your area or it might happen next week. So there is no schedule for this. Please don't come for me in the comments saying it's not fair, etc. It's just how the stores do it and how they tag things. And uh, I, you know, it is what it is. So um, as I made a video uh, of the selected candy that was on clearance, uh, I found it on Saturday. I know a lot of you scored a lot of it, but there's even more to this because Ibotta has rebates. Uh, there was 25 cents for a Hershey's chocolate and these little crunchers. Um, in fact, we're part of it. So it made this bag 17 cents after everything was said and done. Special shout out to a subscriber who sent me a message about this because she's like, hey, I think you might have some money. And you know what? She was like right on the money about it because I think I got back like 325, which was really nice. So um, if you might have these Ibotta rebates, like look through your account and see what you might have and photograph that receipt for Ibotta. And then for these um, Godiva masterpieces, these little uh, candy bars, a dollar back for each. So that was a 71 cent moneymaker after everything was said and done. So definitely if you've been on the candy hunt and scored some candy, look through your Ibotta account, photograph that receipt because there might be some really big rebates for you. And even on Sunday, uh, the store that I visited, I was still finding more candy. Now I do apologize about this. Uh, this was not in the matchups and it was also not in my haul yesterday. Um, I had a million things on the go and uh, just not paying attention, you know. So the uh, Crest toothpaste is $2.99 and when you buy two, you get back 4,000 points. And this wonderful digital coupon showed up yesterday, which is a three off a two. Some of the other coupons, like the five off a three or the seven off of four, larger denominations of toothpaste you have to buy. But if you just want to grab two, use this one. So here's the math for this one, guys. Grabbing two of those tubes priced at $2.99. And please make sure that they're tagged, that they're part of this promotion. Subtracting that three off a two digital coupon, you're going to pay $2.98 out of pocket or you can use points, your choice. You're gonna get back 4,000 points, making it free plus a dollar to money maker. And again, if you wish to use points to pay down your balance, you can earn spend points to earn points for this scenario. This also showed up in my Walgreens account, which is 5,000 when I, when I spend 50. Uh, this is for the week of the 24th to 30th. This is a big one. In the comments down below, guys, I would appreciate to hear what you specifically got. Uh, for this one, I'm not spending 50 bucks. Hey, I'm not rich, uh, so that's not happening, but I would like to hear what you got. Um, and if they're smaller ones, that's the ones I wanna hear about. Okay, guys, so let's talk about clearance. And again, I visited a couple stores and a lot of the stuff, either 50 to 70 to 90% off. We have these women's earplugs for $3.59. Not a lot of savings, but uh, if this is something that you need, you know, maybe something to stock up on. And then um, this is also 50% off, which are these contact lens cases. So a lot of stuff like in that wellness aisle, uh, medication, that sort of stuff, a lot of it was between 50 to 70% off. So... You know, just keep your eyes uh, peeled for that. And then the always discreet liners for uh, $2.79. So that's also uh, like 50% off in that neighborhood. Now, um, there is a $2 coupon in the May P&G that's valid till the 30th. So utilizing that coupon, you'd pay 79 cents for this product. This was something interesting that I found in the clearance section. It's a Gillette Fusion 5. And this looks like a like a Christmas kit almost, because I've never really seen this, but maybe I'm living under a rock. And this guy was $8.99. Because it has the bank of um, cartridges and the razor, I'm thinking maybe if you have a coupon for like $4 off some cartridges, that might work for this. Um, so it was, I believe, $8.99. Sorry, the sticker is quite dated. Um, so it would be down to $4.99. That's a lot for this. But hey, maybe if you needed a Father's Day gift or something like that, you know, possibly maybe you have a gift right here. Use the Walgreens app to scan this product to see what digital coupons are applying um, because what a great little deal you might have there. And then these little lip balms were 50% off and like I that's still a lot 69 cents for one of these. You obviously have the right to use points to pay down your balance for this too, but I would rather see these at 70 to 90% because I like that's how I like to shop over there. But there are a lot of these like um cherry ones and it's just some sort of lip balm i think in the next couple of weeks this might drop down to 70 90 percent would be really great 
but we'll just have to wait and see what happens. But 69 cents is still a little bit for these products. Sorry about the out of focus photo, guys. I thought that was sharp as a tack, but I guess it's not. Lots of the Burt's Bees lipsticks are 50% off, so $4.49. Of course, like make sure that the color is part of the sticker, because that's the worst thing when you pick something up and they're like, that'll be $8.99. You're like, I thought it was supposed to be $4.99. At checkout, I hate when that happens, so um, definitely be smart when you're at checkout. And then lots of these skin products are 50% uh, off as well. Now for the month of June, um, skincare will be buy two, get one for free. That will be back. So um, even if you find a bunch of these at $8.99, they will not fly off the shelves. So possibly in June, we'll have a deal to go with that. Uh, but a lot of this stuff on clearance. And then even more night cream by Burt's Bees. Um, I guess this one just did not take off with uh, consumers and it's 50% off and really nice to see that. I would love to see some coupons for this too. Now these Epsom salts, uh, two nineteen down to a dollar sixty nine, but then there's a sticker behind it that says two for three. I don't know if it was in the wrong area or what, but um, it would be cheaper to buy it for a dollar fifty. But I'm not really sure um, if it was in the wrong area or not. Uh, but Epsom is definitely something to stock up on always. This uh, thing to put on your um, fake lashes is thirty seven cents. Um, so if you do like a full face of makeup and uh, you know you need this to help you um, fix your eyelashes. That's a really great price point. Um, and it's always great to have one of these too in your makeup kit. The VIX Sweet Dreams Cool Mist Humidifier for $34.99. The original price point for this was almost 60 bucks. And I guess it projects um, like patterns on the ceiling as well for a little kid. So that would be really nice. And just to show you what the sticker is, um, immaculately clean floor there. And uh, $34.99 right there. Now, lots of medical products, um, this Fiberlax or supplement, whatever you want to call it, $16.99 down to $13.79. Uh, typically what happens is one of these Tuesdays, all of this stuff will hit 90% off. So if there's something that you've been keeping your eye on, definitely walk by that aisle. $5.49 down to $3.89. Lots of the Walgreens brand medication stuff. I don't know if this stuff is going to be uh, discontinued or what, but very inexpensive. And then this, um, an acetaminophen, so like a, a Tylenol noun drowsy, $7.49 down to $4.49. Um, so definitely people are not buying this stuff either. They're going into the pharmacy, buying whatever they need, walking in, walking out. They're not really browsing the clearance stuff. This guy for $5.49 down to $3.89. So like some not bad finds here uh, medical wise. And typically what I've known in the past uh, for this sort of shopping is that one day everything's 90. So, you know, and then this kid's um, cold and runny nose. So it's like similar to the Tylenol kids for cold and flu. Um, and it's 50% off at $2.49. And definitely always check the expiry dates. You don't want to be buying something that's expired or, you know, just not good anymore. But yeah, all of this stuff sooner or later will hit 90 or 70 or 90 really quick. Okay, so Mother's Day, um, this stuff is tagged to be this price, I believe, until uh, June the 6th or the 9th, and it's 70% off, these little cups. And then looking at the sticker a little more closely, there you go, June the 6th. So maybe on June the 7th, it'll hit like 80 or 90, wouldn't that be nice? But some of these products that are like $5.99, it's down to $1.79, $7.99 down to $2.39. So, you know... <laughs> Maybe just buy it for your mom. Don't keep it for next year. Um, <laughs> these little keychains that said mom or grandma, 70% off. So they were $3.89 and then down to $1.19. All found in the clearance section too. It wasn't in a special area. It was just like back in the back of the store near the pharmacy. This Mother's Day, it's a talking bear, which is really sweet. So if you wanted to present a message or something like that, you can record it. Um, I tried to buy my mom in the past stuffed animals like this and she thinks it's the worst gift because she hates the fact that the bear is looking at her. So this one isn't a recordable bear. It's just a regular teddy bear and 70% off. So it's $2.99 and they're very sizable teddy bears too. I actually think that looks like my cat pumpkin, the big pink one. It's got the big puppy dog eyes. So did any of you ever do that, that you look at a toy and you're like, yeah, that looks like my cat or my dog. <laughs> Anyhow, that looks like a, that looks like pumpkin. And uh, here it is, $2.99. So it was 10 down to $2.99 at 70% off. 
And now we have some canine carryout. So a larger bag, it's 25 ounces of these dog treats down to $3.89. Unfortunately, not a lot of cat treats on clearance this go around. I would have loved to have seen some cheap litter, but that was not the case. And then these more expensive, uh, fancy dancy organic pet treats for $7.99. Still kind of expensive if you ask me. Now we're going to talk about some food. We have some Starbucks K-Cups or this uh, coffee for $4.99 or four seventy four, depending which one you want. Let's hope this is not from last summer because that might be really expired coffee. So definitely check your expiry dates. We have different canned salmon, sardines. Um, the salmon was, I believe, $0.59 cents, and then a buck seventy nine or $1.19 for the sardines. So your choice. And more candy. We had these big sour crunchy crawlers for $0.74. Cents. These were found right at checkout. So um, they were trying to entice shoppers to buy them. And the Sophie May peanut brittle for 19 cents so that's 90 percent off um this is one thing nobody was touching because some stores i would find like five or six i only got like five of them i didn't really buy ev absolutely everything of this but uh i found a lot of this at various stores and uh i just got a couple for my mom um i didn't go too crazy with this item but for whatever reason it wasn't selling and they had a ton of it a lot of stores that i visited and the Sour Patches little box of um, gummies for 69 cents. So, I mean, not the greatest price, but if that's your favorite, that might be something to grab. We have the Swedish Fish, M Swedish Fish Minis for 59 cents. Not a bad little price point, so it's a little bag of those candies. Okay, and we have the Dove um, Bourbon Vanilla Candy Bars. It's a dark chocolate bar for 29 cents, so 90% off. Um, this is a very um, delicious type of chocolate. I love it. I bought a bunch of them at one store, and then I bought even more. Um, I really like it, especially if you're a fan of dark chocolate. It's just very, very um, savory and delicious. And the Godiva Masterpieces, as you guys know, I got a dollar rebate from Ibotta. Um, this one, the Milk Chocolate Hazelnut Oyster for 29 cents, and then a dollar rebate from Ibotta, making it a money maker. And then these Hershey's Crunchers for 42 cents, and there was a little quarter rebate on Ibotta, so making it extremely cheap. So you might want to keep your eye out for that. And the Happy Birthday Candy was 49 cents. One store it was full price, then the two stores it was at ringing up for 49 cents, so go and figure that one out. And then um, the Brookside, these little uh, crunchy clusters at 49 cents each, so 90% off. And lots of these stores that I visited, there was only like one or two in stock. This big bag of um, Lifesavers uh, mints uh, for $3.49. As you can see, there's a dollar peely affixed right to the package, so it would drop it down to $2.49. So, I mean, who doesn't need a big bag of mints? A bit too high for my price range. Um, I mean, I could have used points to pay that down, but I didn't buy it. But let's hope that it drops even further in the next week or two. Now, the last thing I want to talk about is um, stuff that's, you know, I haven't seen it in the store for a while, but there's it's, start, it's starting to get replenished. And it's lots of items that people were panic buying or just buying everything in sight. And around here, the limit for most like um, hand sanitizer, toilet paper, um, stuff like cleaners is two per customer and um, I'm following that to the letter or just grabbing one because I don't want to be that person that you know just buys everything but this is one item that I've been seeing a lot in the stores it's these single rolls of the Walgreens toilet paper so they're two for a dollar um, or 10 for five and this is one item I'm absolutely going to be loading up on um, my plan is I want to have a laundry basket full so if I have a neighbor or a relative that needs one roll of toilet paper in the future hey I got you covered because um, sometimes mailing um, a box of toilet paper it's easier to pack these smaller ones than a huge thing of cottonelle um, if you've been doing the same like me you know exactly what I'm talking about just these you can really shoehorn a bunch in um, to a box and it's probably easier than sending like a huge you know thing of toilet paper that's a weird goofy shape but this is something I want to stuck up on when all this craziness is over and two different stores that I visited had uh, different masks. Uh, this one was $12.99. Even using 10,000 points, you would pay $2.99 for this. I know that my mom is very um, selective of what she can put on her face. She's very sensitive to scents and smells. Um, so I think I'm going to try and grab some of these for her because I know it's going to be very hard where she lives to, to grab this. So I think this is something that she would do really well with. And 20, that's a lot for her. So, um, you know, especially if she really paces herself for her trips outdoors. And then there's also so this larger one for 
So almost $30 for uh, 50 of these masks. And um, I believe this was one per customer. They were really limiting people. But I have not seen this at Walgreens since in January. They didn't even have it because I was looking for it in January just for fun and nothing. So anyhow, guys, as always, thanks for watching. Good luck with your clearance shopping. Again, this is always a your mileage may vary. And I will catch you guys in the next one.